How can you calculate mean absolute deviation in Excel? Are you curious about how to calculate mean absolute deviation in Excel? This statistical measure helps us understand how spread out our data points are. It shows the average distance of each data point from the mean, making it a handy tool in data analysis. Let's break down the steps to calculate mean absolute deviation in Excel. First, you need to enter your data into a column in Excel. For example, if your data is in cells A2 through A16, you are ready to start. Next, you will want to find the mean of your data set. To do this, you can use the average function. In a new cell, let's say D1, type the formula, equals average open parenthesis A to colon A16 close parenthesis. Press enter, and you will have the mean of your data. Now that you have the mean, it's time to calculate the absolute deviations. In a new column, starting from cell B2, you will calculate the absolute deviation of each data point from the mean. To do this, you will use the abs function. If your mean is in cell D1, type the formula. Equals abs open parenthesis A to minus dollar sign D dollar sign one close parenthesis. This formula will give you the absolute deviation for the first data point. Once you have entered this formula in B2, you can drag the fill handle down to apply it to all data points in your dataset. This will calculate the absolute deviations for each value in your column. Finally, to find the mean absolute deviation, you will need to average these absolute deviations. In a new cell, let's say E1, type the formula, equals average open parenthesis B to colon B16 close parenthesis. Press enter, and you will have the mean absolute deviation for your dataset. And there you have it. You have successfully calculated the mean absolute deviation in Excel. This measure of dispersion helps you understand how closely your data points cluster around the mean. It's a straightforward process that can provide valuable information for your data analysis.